We did great in the second half. First half, we played horrible. You know, we went there defensively. We were lackadaisical. We played with really no energy. And, um, and they gave us everything we wanted and more. And I think the second half, we definitely did a great job coming out more energetic, more focused on the defensive end. And, uh, and we were able to convert. The offensive man more tell me a lot of big shots tonight, a lot of open threes, a lot of corner threes, and just a lot of big plays by everybody. And I think our defense is definitely one of the games. Started off playing as a team, and then we stopped a little bit in the second quarter. And uh, Kevin Love got into a streak and he got hot and started making a lot of shots. And then we just told guys to, uh, to play bad D in the second half. We didn't play good D in the first half, and they got whatever they wanted and uh, got into anything they wanted without nobody pressuring the ball. So we just wanted to do that for the second half. And, uh, we made plays on stretch in the fourth quarter, even though they made big shots. We made big ones and got a couple stops. This is, this is definitely big for us moving forward because we know we're capable of winning. And tonight we definitely put it together. You know, we, we wish our first quarter and our, first, and our second quarter and our first half in general could have been a lot better. But, uh, I think the, what Witt always preached on is the last four minutes of the game. And we definitely did a great job of just sticking with it, playing great defense, getting stops, and being able to convert on that end. And they're, they're not trying to stop you. They want to outscore you. Right. And um, the fact that we were able to buckle down, get a decent stance and get stops, um, it's key, especially with a team that likes to put up uh, you know, high numbers like that. It's about the first team that plays defense, and it's the team that's going to come up. I, I was baiting him uh, because coach, he got me in the first half on the shot that he turns over his right shoulder. He always turns over his right shoulder. So I, I remember the exact same play. I was going to bait him to thinking I'm forcing him middle, so to speak, and then cut the middle off, and then cut his shoulder off. And eventually, I was able to get a piece of the ball. So uh, I think I did a pretty good job just keeping my hands to myself and, and not following as much as possible. I think it was a little better getting to the free throw line a little bit, but uh, I just think my teammates. I did a great job finding my teammates, and that's the biggest key of just trusting those guys and believing those guys to make plays and knowing that I don't have to make all the plays every time. You know? That's something we did, and uh, Bradley got high a little bit, and we started letting him come out the bar and come out the doors, and it was big for us. Manny was huge. He was huge throughout the whole game. You know, both of them before. He did a great job on Kevin Love. Kevin Love got he made a lot of he made a lot of threes. There's really nothing he could do about that. Thing. So I mean, he definitely stuck with it. And he continued to defend his butt off. And he was on him on both ends of the floor, and he was able to score. And he definitely kept us in the game. Johnny's a continued to do this. I mean, we never pass a ball shots. If he if he were going to continue to go under on him. And he and there's space created. We want him to shoot that shot because we probably won't get a better shot than one that you know, we've ever hit. And it's up to him to continue to just stay confident. If he miss a few, they always tell me just keep shooting. We're going to tell him to keep shooting. Never get down on himself. And he's always facilitating. Yeah, he has 16 assists, so I mean, that's, that speaks for itself. As long as he continues to do that, and, that's, and we continue to make shots, it, it makes his job a lot better.